Welcome to App Judgment, your source for mobile app news and reviews from Revision 3. I'm Annie Gauss, and today we're here with Benjamin Heckendorn, a.k.a. Ben Heck, a.k.a. the star of The Ben Heck Show on the Revision 3 Network. Hello, everyone. That's a lot of AKAs. <laughs> and for those of us who have not seen the show, for those of you who have not seen the show, tell us about it. Well, The Ben Heck Show is a bi-weekly show that is on element14.com as well as Revision 3. It's distributed to you as well. And what we do is we take great viewer submissions of cool projects that people want to see made, and then we try to make them happen on the show. So basically, it's an electronics hobbyist um, show about building things. And we try to make cool things. We've done like a see-through portal t-shirt. We've made uh, you know, robot luggage and all sorts of cool stuff. So what's been your personal favorite hack? Probably the robot luggage. I really liked uh, how it... I don't know, it's the luggage that follows you around because you know it was one of those things where you see a problem like I hate carrying all that crap to the airport and the luggage. So it's like, what could solve this? And you know, it's the year 2012, why don't we have robot luggage? So if, um, what, we, what we did was a, it's a carry-on and if you snap the handle down, the wheel pops up, much like R2-D2, you know, so it has support. And then it uses uh, uh, sonar to follow you. You actually have a transmitter thing on your belt. It's like chirp, chirp, chirp. Yeah, well, but it's inaudible. Or it's all the dogs in your are like, rrr, 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 turn that off. But anyway, yeah, it follows you via sonar ping, like a dolphin, but not as cute. <laughs> it's a little, it's pretty cute though. It's a little yeah, cute. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> so what do you, what else do you got? Oh yeah, so we did another app for um, the show. It was called the Ben Stir. Let me bring it up here. Let's see, B, Ben, okay. So this was used for our show. And uh, you, what you do is this, you have a mechanical thing that actually stirs your food on the stove for you because I don't like cooking. I, I mean, I have to eat, unfortunately. I wish I could just, you know, run off batteries or an IV or something. So if I have to cook some food and I'm like, you know, I don't want to do this. I go in the other room and I'm like, I go back to reading Den of Geek or whatever. <laughs> but my food burns. So I thought, hey, it'd be cool if we made a thing where I could just sit there and every so often, you know, push the slider and cause this thing to stir for me robotically in the other room. So yeah, that's the app we put together. And then it randomly loads up a different type of soup right there also the planet Jupiter because it looks like soup so yeah it, it, and it connects via Bluetooth so this is one that we put together for the show um, Ben by the way is the master of uh, what we call lazy man inventions <laughs> my, fa my favorite being the hot pocket dispenser oh I yes with the Xbox <laughs> like oh man I can't be bothered to do this <laughs> yeah that was fun to build uh, it, oh, well, another one that was really popular was the Xbox disc changer we uh, we got this some um, 50 disc Sony changer you know like back in the day you know pre iPod or whatever and uh, you know you you can remotely change it and load your game so you can swap out your game on your console without um, changing I mean that'll all be you know, null and void in like three years and all the consoles go download only, which they will. Uh, but, uh, you know, there's, that was a request people years and years. People are like, why don't you make a disc changer for, for a game console? And I'm like, that doesn't make much sense. But with the show, it's like, well, here's an opportunity. We built it and people loved it. So you never know people will like it until you do it. So, Ben, you're an imaginative person. You're capable of making things. What would be your dream app? Well, maybe not my ultimate dream app, but something I think would be useful. Well, I like pinball machines, right? And um, But the pinball machines need to be level. Well, not level. They need to be level this way, but then this, the tilt of the play field where the ball rolls, needs to be 6, 6.5, or 7 degrees typically. So it's hard to do that. Even when, when you have a friend to help you, it's hard to do. But if you're by yourself, you're like just, you know, tinkering on pinball some night, it's even harder. Or if you're a distributor, you know, you take it into the bar and you're not going to be like, hey, help me, with, you know, level this pinball machine. The guy will be like, screw you. So my dream app is you take your phone and you set it on the play field like this, right? And it would basically just be a voice call out bubble level. And then, because you have to crawl into the machine and adjust the bolts to like get the tilt right. So then you go down under there and you're like, okay, go. And the phone would be like 6.5 degrees, raise left leg. I don't know why I need to talk like a robot since obviously <laughs> I didn't have to. But it would basically, it, it, would, it would simulate a friend calling out, you know, how the bubble level is doing. So, you know, I think, you know, especially someone that might, you know, install a machine and not have to do it by themselves and not have help, I think it might be useful. So any of you app designers out there, go right ahead and steal it. You could probably sell at least 10 copies on the marketplace <laughs> for pinball fans. I don't know, maybe it's one of those things, again, you never know until you try. Yeah. So. If anyone out there wants to build that for Ben, perhaps, where can they find you? Uh, you can go to uh, element14.com forward slash TBHS. That's the Ben Heck Show uh, page. You can also submit any kind of cool project idea you might want to see on my show. Or you can say, hey, I'd love to program that app for you. And you can even take all the money. Just, just make it happen. It just needs <laughs> to exist. Uh, yes, also, I have my own website, www.benheck.com. All right, excellent. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you.
And as always, you can find us on revision3.com slash appjudgment, as well as all over the web, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, and Google+. Plus. Ciao. Have an appy day. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.